the only video you need to consume of how to actually go about navigating around LinkedIn in 2024. In this video, I'm going to show you what to do. This is actually a diagram I actually done for one of my clients on a coaching call. I've just covered her name, but this is the exact steps I took her through to actually start generating some clients on LinkedIn in 2024. So let's dive straight into it. Before you do that though, guys, like and subscribe. I know a lot of you have been consuming my content. I appreciate that, but I really appreciate if you can actually subscribe and like the page. So yeah, let's dive straight into it. So this is the profile funnel. When someone actually, you know, comes across your profile on LinkedIn, they'll firstly read your, your LinkedIn content and then they'll visit your LinkedIn profile, they'll read your banner, and then they'll read your headline and hashtags, they'll check your feature section, they'll read your about section, and then hopefully they'll either follow or inquire about you. This is the exact profile funnel that a stranger takes from first coming across your content to actually following you. And in this video, I'm actually gonna to explain to you how you can get a stranger from this step for reading the content all the way to following you, connecting with you, and you know, potentially just asking for a call with you. And so as we scroll down, so step one, profile optimization. So it's super important to start your profile page, in my opinion. It's probably the most important thing on LinkedIn because essentially when someone clicks your profile, you have about five to 10 seconds for them to understand what you do. If you're not clear with what you do, I mean, before you know it, they'll be going in a flash. So it's super important to start your banner. Personally, me, in my banner, I literally just state what I do. So I help, you know, coaches convert more in the DMs on LinkedIn. It's literally there simple so within 10 seconds someone knows what i do and how i can help them and i also give them a call to action so if they're interested in booking a call i just literally say go to featured section and book a call so i don't want to make their life too hard i don't want to give them too much to do i don't want them to you know struggle to find a way to contact me so i just want to make their life as simple as possible so in terms of your headline i mean this is just a headline i've done for my client the headline needs to be sort of short sharp to the point what you do don't be saying leadership coach communication coach agency owner speaker this and that if you are looking to potentially get more people in your program you just literally need to say i help x audience to do whatever you help them to do in time frame like literally short sharp to the point you just want to get to the point that i need to emphasize how important it is guys to just literally get to the point because people don't care about you they just care about how you can help them so that's why i'm saying this and then in your feature section you want to pin a few things you want to pin some testimonials a calendar link for someone to just book a call for you your website too because you want to drive people away from linkedin and then some free resources like for me personally i have an ebook i have like a free linkedin profile template if you go on my linkedin now just type in joshua the bell you can actually get get that for free so yeah super important to pin all those things in your feature section so as you scroll down to the about section i personally then i still want to talk about my clients and how i can help them so i answer questions like are you struggling too then i list out all the problems that a potential client that i want to work with is struggling with how i can help them what are they say this is when i want to include some testimonials and things like that you know real life testimonials you want to put their names and what they do and then just to give them a contact if they want to work with us go on my website my calendar link or just shoot me a message on dm or email me so they, they're sort of clear on what they have to do so that's that so in terms of step two so step two is content in my opinion super important i personally post content every day but when i first started i was posting you know two to three times a week so if you're first starting or if you don't have time that's fine two to three times a week if it's super valuable then that's more than enough for you to uh, you know grow a following and start monetizing an audience and i just put it sort of consistency is key don't be posting two to three times a week for a month and give up even if you have to post once a week for the whole year that's better than just posting two to three times a week for like two months so make sure you are consistent with that scheduling posts to save time so i personally use a website called buffer super super good it's for free so you can schedule posts for like 10 days in advance and then i think they've got a subscription they've got cobble pricing and stuff like that but it's so it's honestly so cheap so my posts um, are scheduled like 30 40 days in advance so i don't have to think about posting content for the next 40 days so you know saves me a lot of time and then in terms of the content structure i personally like doing like long form copy with um the basic stuff like i said the hook the meet the summary and then the call to action i like doing long form and then a picture videos for some weird reason linkedin doesn't really like that it doesn't really reach out to as many people as i personally think it should i don't know why linkedin does that it just is what it is we just have to deal with it and adapt so yeah as i said here three parts of how to write effective copy you first want to hook your audience in so once someone's scrolling on linkedin you want them to be able to sort of stop and actually, okay, this sounds interesting. So like a hook, here are three ways to generate clients in 2024. 
here are three ways to get positive replies on LinkedIn in the DMs of 2024. So that would hopefully hook someone. And then you want to state how you can do that. So with the meet, and then you want to summarize it all. So they don't actually have to go up on your post and actually check what you've said, because you know people just forget. So you want to summarize it. And then you want to give them a call to action, a call to conversation. A call to action could be, if you find this valuable, like, and I'll send you a free PDF, or I'll shoot you a DM, or you can call to conversation. Let me know your thoughts, guys. Did I miss out on anything? So something like that. So step three, connect, engage, and comment in. And I actually didn't realize the power of this, you know. I'm not perfect. I didn't realize how effective commenting is. And I'm currently trying to comment at least 25 times a day on people with big followings and stuff because the way you're able to actually generate clients and people potentially interested in working with you by leveraging other people's platforms, pretty insane. So that's something I would definitely recommend you guys to do start connecting start engaging most importantly start commenting i would probably say after posting commenting is as important i'll probably say it's probably more important than posting if especially if you're commenting something really valuable you're not just like posting something useless like oh thanks for sharing like you're actually posting something valuable that doesn't just educate the person actually posting but everyone that the content creator has as followers so super important doing that to break it down even more so like i said this is for a coaching client so i told her connect with 40 people a day worked out to be 200 a week super easy shouldn't take you too long to do that week's message i personally i've tried pitching at the start and stuff it's worked for me i mean i've pitched from the outreach message and i've managed to get clients from that but the more sort of positive replies i've got is when i haven't pitched so i'll suggest you guys to don't pitch i want to give you guys the best advice and i simply say you know hey first name hope you're doing well I notice on your profile so this is for a client that um, as a coaching call as I said I notice on your profile that you're you're in a leadership role in the company I help organizations that you want to be specific like help organizations leaders I told it to be more specific like leaders what does that mean organizations what kind of organizations is that the more specific you are the better and then enhance their team dynamics and performance it will be good to connect then once they connect you want to offer something to them for free and just have a casual conversation so i say and yeah you don't want to pitch someone anything you do right now and i said comments and engaging 10 to 15 people a day if you can comment something valuable for everyone to learn from not just the creator so step four outbound so if you actually want to actually go ahead and look for people that are interested in your services linkedin group super 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 good if you just join groups you can message unlimited people on groups so super valuable so you can do that send 100 200 messages a day 50 messages a day hire a va to do it you can do sales now sales now is obviously a subscription i think it's 80 dollars a month and then just search tab so you can just type in on the search tab your target audience and then ask to connect um this is an outreach group you can use hey first name hope you're doing great i noticed on your profile that you're you know leadership in your company help organizations blah 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 it would be good to connect so that's for outbound guys and if you're liking this video um if you find this video valuable please you know like and subscribe i truly appreciate that so as we scroll down to inbound so this is my inbound strategy this is literally what i personally use and actually got a client this week from doing this exact thing so take this part in guys so if someone likes comments or follows you you don't message them straight away but you message them maybe the next day in a few hours and you say to them hey happy new year just wanted to say i appreciate so she commented on my post i said i appreciate the comment you gave me the other day um, and then i said i hope it can help you generate all the business you deserve this year have a great week ahead and she replied back saying something something very nice and then i offered her something for free so I offered a free audit on her profile, a quick five minute video explaining how she can improve her profile, optimize it more, make it more clear, make it more niche specific. And she absolutely loved it. And then I offered her something free again. So I asked for feedback. She said, it was absolutely amazing. Thanks for the video. I really love this, etc." If you want me to create another video, particularly like of how to do this and actually show you the messaging i don't mind there's got nothing to hide and then i offered her some some free content like linkedin templates i have she absolutely loved that again and then i said to her i'm, I'm really glad you like all these stuff um, why don't we potentially get on a call and have a chat and she was like look josh i'm really interested in working with you you know you didn't pitch me straight away you took your time out to get to know me etc i really want to work with you so i pretty much just closed her literally there and then got on a call with her and ended up closing her so that was super super cool so when you're actually booking a call super important guys 
I like to give two days and two times. So I would be like, you know, hey prospect, I'm glad to know you want to call. I have some availability, 9 a.m. Eastern or Wednesday, 1 p.m. Central. So I'm going to give them two options. You don't want to have to let them think too much. Just make their life easy so they can just pick one time. I literally did the same thing for two minutes ago and it worked and I booked a call. So that's it, guys. Um, like I said, if you like this video, um, found this video valuable, like, subscribe, tell a friend and firmly believe this is the only video you need to watch of how to actually generate you know, clients on LinkedIn. I mean, this is what I literally um, mapped out for one of my clients that she's literally paid for this and it's not cheap to get on a call for me for an hour. So yeah, that's pretty much it guys. Take care, speak soon.